He's coming! Ah! All right, Barbie, all we need is one more push. Three, two, one, push! Ah! Look, you have a beautiful baby girl. Great job, Barbie. She's beautiful. That baby's mine. What? No! No! Give it back! You won't be the black swan for long. What? Black Swan now. No! <gasps> What's going on? We're in a program. What? Someone trapped us in here. Who was it? Look! Welcome, Rebecca. You're trapped in the Every Birth to Death program. If you can't complete all four levels, you and your friends will be stuck in this program forever. We don't know anyone with curly hair like that. The first level is cheerleader. Look, the hour clock. <gasps> Let's go, Toro! We're here to win, we're here to fight, to fight with all their might. Win! She needs to go to the hospital! Oh, the baby's coming! Oh, she's leaking! Just one more push! This is harder than nationals! Oh. oh my goodness! It is a beautiful baby girl, Mom. Hi, sweet girl! What are we gonna name her? Can you hold her for one second? Sure. Whoa, whoa, please be careful. You just get hurt. Give me an R E B E C C A. What does that spell? Rebecca! My baby's name is Rebecca! Go! Oh, oh, oh no! Take it down! What happened to Rebecca's mom? Is she okay? It's so exciting! Her first birthday! <sighs> Rebecca! This is your first birthday! I can't believe it! Today's gonna be the best day ever because your mom planned a very special birthday. It's cheer theme! And you know, mommy hasn't worn this in a little bit, but she got it out because today I'm gonna be cheering for the first time with you! Your first cheer, isn't that exciting? I forgot to light the cake! Okay. Candles are in the kitchen, I'll be right back. Look at you, you're gonna be walking any day now that you're one. One day you're gonna be just like your mom and go to nationals too! It's time to cheer! Your first time cheering! Grab a pom pom, shake it! Shake it! I'm gonna show you my cartwheel. Go, go Rebecca! Happy first birthday! Mommy doesn't feel it. Happy birthday to Shannon. Hey, wake up! Wake up! Are you okay? Shannon, Shannon, wake up! Wake up! Wake up! What? What happened? You just fainted. What were you doing? I fainted again. I was just cheering with my daughter for the first time. Rebecca, you okay? Come here, Rebecca. We need to go to the okay? doctors right now. Why? You keep on fainting every time you try to cheer. I'm fine. You should not be holding a baby right now. I said I'm fine. I, I said I was fine. You need to go see the doctor. Where's Rebecca? She's heading to cheer camp next. Her mom was a national champion, so I'm sure she's going to be great. I can't believe we're going to cheer camp. Let's do our song. Two, four, six. Rebecca, Lindsay, you guys are going to love cheer camp. Back when I was your age, I went with my best friend and we learned all of the skills that took us to nationals eventually. You went to nationals and she won. And she can still do a round off that can't spring backflip. No way. Yep, I did that. I'm not really supposed to be doing that anymore. Show her, do it. Your dad's upstairs, put your stuff down. I'll do it really quickly, come on. Rebecca's mom is doing a tumbling move. The doctor says she's not supposed to do that anymore. Is she gonna be okay? This is how you do a round off that can't spring backflip. I'm just gonna use the bathroom. Mom! Mom! Dad! Dad! Rebecca! Mom! Come on, come on, come on. Get out! Come on! Wake, Mom! Wake up, wake up, wake up! What happened? She was tumbling! She's not supposed to tumble, that's what causes her to faint! She never told me that! Mom! Wake up, wake up, wake up! Mom! Come on, come on. Okay, I got to do CPR. Wake up! Mom! Wake up! Mom! I'm so sorry, Mom. If I didn't ask you to do that move, this would never happen. Rebecca, you okay? I messed her too. She was saving something for you, and I thought today would be a good day to give this to you. Your mom made this, and here's the key to get inside. But your mom said you cannot open this until you win nationals. Why not? She said you wouldn't understand what's inside. I love you. <laughs>
I'm so nervous about this. We have to make the cheerleading team. This is perfect. Rebecca has her bestie on the team to cheer her up. Now, this is gonna be great. You see all the people here? They're really talented. You're gonna be fine. You brought it, right? You mean the lockbox? I obviously want to see what's inside this lockbox, but there's no way I can make the team. We're gonna make the team and then win nationals so you can open that lockbox. Tryouts are starting. It's your besties. Let's do this. Welcome to tryouts. Yeah, welcome to tryouts. As you know, we won nationals last year mm -hmm. and we want to win again. We're gonna need a team that's up to the task. Up to the task. Okay, go, audition. <laughs> All right, first up. I hope you guys like old school. Y M C A. Woo! Woo! Ah, she hit the floor. She hit the floor. Yes. Hey, what's up? I'm Derek. Here to audition. Thank you. Not another dancer. They're just wannabe cheerleaders. <laughs> my name's Claire and this is my audition. Go team! Go team! Go Toro! What are those moves? That will never work in a cheer formation. Mm -mm. Lindsay, you're up. You've got this. Step one to going to nationals. Oh no, come on, stay up. Hold that scale. Go team. Was that okay? I think I stumbled on the last part. No, it was totally fine. They're definitely gonna see how good you are. Next step? Oh no, Come I'm on. this. Yeah. Hi, I'm Rebecca. Let's go Toros! Let's go Toros! Go team! Here's the results of the final cheer team. If I call your name, please leave. Please leave. Derek, Stacy, Michelle, and last and least, Lindsay. Everyone else, please go get sized for your uniforms. <laughs> I didn't make the team. Well, then I'm not gonna join the team if you are. No, Rebecca, you have to join the team so that you can go to nationals and open that lockbox. I wanna do this, but I can't do this without you. You're the reason I'm here. We're cheer besties. Oh. Remember the promise? We are, but do it for your mom. No, um, I can't. Lindsay, I called your name. Why are you still here? Yeah, why? Because I'm talking to her. Can we just have a moment, please? Uh, no, I called your name. Now leave. What? <gasps> Rebecca, you have to stay. What? How can you do that to Lindsay? She didn't deserve that. I'm the head cheerleader. I can do whatever I want. Uh, yeah, she can. <laughs> and besides, don't you want to win nationals so you can open that box? From your mom. And the only way to do that, I think, is to be on a cheer team, right? Mm -hmm. So if you want to be on our team, you have to play by our rules. Mm -hmm. See you at practice tomorrow. Bye-bye. <laughs> I hate that big red! But she still has to work with her, especially since the next one is homecoming week. This is stressing me out. All right, ladies, this week is homecoming, and that means we will be doing our routine in front of the whole school. Yeah, the whole school. So it needs to be perfect. Mm -hmm. Perfect. Uh, if you just, like, I can't right now. Rebecca, can you just, like, go over the routine with them? Sure. Everyone line up. Five, six, seven, out, out, arms up, and wrap, and wrap. Step, clap, step, clap, step, clap, step, clap. <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm not laughing at you girls. Look at those dancers over there. None of them are doing the same thing. They're like noodles, weak, bland, and no one remembers them. <laughs> I actually think their moves are pretty cool. I think it's time for lunch. Let's mm -hmm. go girls. Mm -hmm. I just have to get to Nashville. It's all the wannabe cheerleaders that didn't make the team. <laughs> <laughs> and here's the biggest loser of them all. At least they have some talent. You have no talent whatsoever. <laughs> I hate that big red. She bullies everyone. We know, Matt. How about you and your clones go eat somewhere else? We're, We're not, not clones. clones. Let's just eat our lunch. This isn't necessary. You're right. This isn't necessary, but this is. <laughs> Eat somewhere else. It smells a little desperate in here. Why? <laughs> <laughs> Lindsay, I'm so sorry. I didn't know she was going to do that. I would have tried to stop her. Why is she so mean to me? I don't know. This is not cool at all. I am done. I am quitting the team. I'm not gonna let her get away with this. Rebecca, you can't quit. Think of your mom and the key to the lockbox. You have to win that. I can't do this though. I can't be a part of a team where the captain is a bully. Remember, we pinky promised we're gonna be cheer besties forever. You can't quit. <laughs> cheer besties? Wish you were cheering with me. No, you're gonna win nationals. You're gonna do it for your mom. That's what's important. 
Rebecca, what are you doing here? I said we're eating somewhere else. I was making sure my best friend was okay. You threw a slushie on her. Say you're sorry. Did that make you upset? Mm hmm I am so sorry. It's gonna be okay. That was uncalled for, but I'm glad you apologized. And I'm also sorry about this. <gasps> Why did you do that, Big Red? <laughs> Let's go, Rebecca. You know what? No, I'm not going. I quit. Rebecca, no. I quit. I don't want to be a part of the cheerleading team. She can't quit. Or else we're going to be trapped in this program forever. I guess you're never going to see your mommy's little lockbox then. And we're still going to win nationals. I bet your mom is looking down at you right now. So disappointed. Hey, don't say that. Bye. Rebecca, you can't quit. I'm sorry. I have to go. <laughs> Someone needs to stand up to her. We are finally getting out of this place. I know that this is hard for you, but your mom would be really proud of you. Thanks to your bestie. All right, everyone settle in. We have a lot of graduating to do today. Speaking of, I would like to say a special congratulations to our cheer team who won nationals this year. And they'll be moving on to try and win college nationals as well. Yeah, everyone clap. I'd like to bring up our cheeratorian to say a few words. <laughs> Thank you. Winning cheer nationals two years in a row was amazing. But the secret to that success was never quitting. Right, Rebecca? Don't listen to her, she's trying to get under your skin. But the secret to our success is all our moms are proud of us. Except for your mom, Rebecca. Cause she's dead. <gasps> You'll never deserve what's in that lockbox. I can't do this! <laughs> <laughs> Cheerleaders, go spread some cheer over there. Over there, get out of here. Take it back! Get out. You guys, stay here. Clean it up. What? You'll never deserve what's in that lockbox. Get out of here, Big Red! Cheerleaders are the worst. No, those cheerleaders are the worst. It's just not fair. All I want is for you to get into that lockbox. I mean, it's impossible unless I won nationals, which clearly I don't. But you guys are dancers, right? I remember at the audition, you guys were really good. And Lindsay and I, we've been cheering our whole life. You guys are going to the local university, right? They don't have a cheerleading team, but we could start one. That sounds good. Let's are you guys it. in? Let's do it. Are we going to start a cheerleading school? We're going to if we want to beat the Toros at Nationals, then we're going to have to do something different. They've been working together forever. But what we have is we have originality. What if we include some dancing moves into our cheerleading routine? Oh, I got it. How about a little pop? We can even do some body rolls. Yeah. Oh. How about we do a peel off? Oh, oh in a line. Oh, That's so perfect. A handstand. A handstand? Yeah, we could do that. Oh. Oh. Maybe that's not the best move. You're a little rusty, that's fine. I think it's time to start practicing. Five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Hop to the right, okay. hop to the left, around. Oh, they're actually kind of good. Shut up, there's no way that we're gonna let them win nationals. Uh, how are you gonna make sure of that? I have a plan. Oh! Oh, we got it, we need a team name. Six, six. six. nationals, here we go. She has to win nationals, otherwise she won't beat this level. Come on, Rebecca! Welcome to the college national championship. It is down to two teams, the reigning national champions, the Toro. <laughs> and the Snakes. Competition will begin in 10 minutes. Come on, guys, come on. We've got this. Everyone told us we couldn't do it, but here we are at nationals and we can win. So let's get set. Go through those routines, I'll be right back. So mom, this is it. I'm really nervous right now. I hope I did the right thing. All I know is I wanna see what's inside that lockbox. What is it that you left for me? I'm gonna win nationals for you, mom. You make sure they're warmed up. I have something to do. You got it. Okay, girls, ready? Here we go. Five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three. Oh. I can't Lindsay! Are you okay? I can't move my mouth. No. Oh no! Okay. Ma'am, please, please back up. We need to get her the okay. Come on, bring in the stretcher. Lindsay! What are we gonna do? We only have four people now. We just need to stay focused until we figure out what happened to Lindsay. Five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Woo! 
good news, it's just a sprain, but that means no physical activity for at least a week, at least. It's not broken? No, it's not broken. Yeah. Wait, 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 get back here. No, no, it's physical activity. Why do the Toros always get to win? They're not even that good. We actually could have won. Rebecca, what are we gonna do? She's back! Now they can win national! Let's go! Lindsay, what are you doing here? It's just a straight neck and they haven't cleared me, but we gotta go, we gotta hurry, come on! No, cheer, hurry. come on, oh, grab them! We are so gonna win. How do you know they still have to cheer? Because they don't have enough people to compete. <laughs> I guess you can't count, because we have five. <laughs> Let's go, you guys! Let's go! They didn't have enough people. They weren't supposed to. And that girl's in a neck brace. There's no way they can win, right? <laughs> no, no, they can't. We're the Toros. We did it! Do you think we'll be national champions? I don't know, but we did our best and that's all that matters. And no matter what the outcome is, just know your mom would be proud. Couldn't have done this without you guys. Oh. It was a close competition, but the first runner up at the national championships of college cheerleading is... You guys, you guys have to be there. What? What are you doing? Where's my box? Where's my lockbox? My lockbox is gone. Where is it? Are you sure you put it there? Zimpan, what happened to the lockbox? If she doesn't get that lockbox, she's not going to be able to complete this level. Exactly. Uh, oh my gosh, oh. Rebecca. It's so good to see you at our tag yeah. reunion. We haven't seen you since college. Since national. Oh, and you're yeah. pregnant. I am, and you guys are too. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> How far along? You guys. Well, I'm doing April. I'm doing May. Yeah, congratulations. You guys are so nice. Actually, would you mind giving us a minute? Can you give us a minute? Uh, can you just stop. Can oh. you just for, okay. Hey, big red. It's been a while. I know it really has, Rebecca. Honestly, I just feel awful about the way we treated you back at nationals. I just hope that we can be friends. Yeah, that was a long time yeah, ago. Exactly. That was like ten years. So long we're different ago. people now, exactly. and we're we're gonna be moms. Like, exactly. of course, Thank I can you. forgive you. Oh, I just felt awful, <laughs> especially too about taking your lockbox. I just feel so awful. Wait, wait, you took my lockbox? Yeah. You know, you guys had just won. I was just feeling so jealous and angry and I didn't have an outlet for that. Do you have it now? I don't remember what I did with it. Like pregnancy brain. I think oh. I threw it away. <laughs> That's okay. It's okay. totally fine. Thank you. I'm really sorry. I can't believe Big Red stole her lockbox. I can't. I hate that girl. Well, it looks like she's going back to nationals. What's gonna happen? <laughs> National Championships, my old stomping ground. Rebecca! Lindsay! Rebecca! Why'd you have me meet here? I mean, does bring back memories winning the National Championships. I actually have something really important to show you. I went to my neighbor's garage sale and- A garage pail? Garage sale. Sale. And it turns out it was that mean head cheerleader, Big Red. Big Dead? She actually is dead, but- Big Dead. Look what I found at her garage sale. I had to bring it to you. Are you okay? Oh my pain. Okay. What is it? I don't know. It's a letter. That feeling you feel right now from winning nationals, hold on to that. Take that feeling and multiply it by one million. That's how I felt to have you. My greatest achievement in life was you. Love, mom. I've been waiting for this. Box since we won national. You finally got to open it. This is the best thing I've ever had. Thank you, cheer bestie. Of course, cheer bestie. <laughs> Rebecca? <sighs> Rebecca! Rebecca! Rebecca, wake up! She's not breathing. My cheer bestie is dead! <laughs> Which means she passed the level! That was emotional, but at least I passed! We still have three more to go. The next level is dancing. Who is that guy? I hate him! <gasps> My water broke! The baby's coming! Is there a doctor in the house? Oh no! We need a doctor! 
One, three, two, one, three, two, one, 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 two, you're my little birthday girl ballerina today. Do you know that mommy was the black swan before she had you? Maybe one day you'll be the black swan. Let's plie and up. Plie and up. That's looking good. Yeah? I think it's time to celebrate the birthday girl. Oh, yeah. We get to have a celebration. You ready, Rebecca? Oh, you know what? Let me grab that. Probably some more treats. Yay. Looks like another birthday gift. Happy birthday from Nina. That was nice of her. Look what mm. Nina sent. Nina sent these? I thought she didn't like you. Well, apparently she does, because I'm pretty sure those are for me. All this amazing oh. food that we have for Rebecca's birthday. I know, I can't believe how many people sent treats. Okay, ease up, ease up. Okay, it is now time to celebrate the birthday girl. Rebecca, happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, birthday to you. you. Now make a wish, Rebecca. Birthday, dear Rebecca. There you go. Yeah. Happy Yay. birthday. Now maybe we give you a little taste. Oh, oh what's going on? Are you okay? I can't feel my legs. I'm gonna call 911. Hello? My husband is on the ground. He left feeling in his legs. Will he ever be able to walk again? I'm afraid we don't believe so. Is there anything that he could have eaten that might have caused this? I mean, it was a party. People sent food. He ate a little bit of everything. I'm afraid if we can't specify the exact food, then we can't diagnose what caused the nerve damage. But it was just sweets. This doesn't make sense. Glad it happened to me and not you. You can still dance. What could have poisoned him? I don't know, but I'm never eating sweets again! Now, now, girls, hands on the bar. Arms out, long neck, shoulders down, excellent, and side tondus. Tondu, tondu, batma, batma, as high as you can, excellent. If you keep training, you both will be able to get into the academy. I want to be the black swan like you. Well, technically, Rebecca, I wasn't officially the black swan. I had to stop my debut early because you came a little bit early, which is why I'm training again so I can officially become the black swan. Are you afraid you're gonna get hurt like the other black swans did? What happened? Oh, okay, enough. Listen, Rebecca, nothing is going to happen to me. Just keep training, everything's gonna be okay, and you are going to get in the academy. We're both gonna have our dreams come true. So let's get back to work, girls. Side tondus again, let's see those. Excellent. Just tond Jennifer? <laughs> Jennifer, what are you doing here? This is my room, I booked for me. I booked the room for my daughter and her best friend to train, and we have 15 more minutes. <laughs> You're training them? There's no way those girls are getting into the academy. The only girl that's getting into the academy is my daughter. There's only one person here that's gonna be the black swan, and it's gonna be me. Nina, your room's over here. I guess you did have the wrong space. Okay, well, bye. bye. Your kids aren't getting in. Who is that? That is Natalie's mom. Natalie's a bully. Seems like your mom is too. Okay, girls, enough, enough. Let's get back to focusing on ballet and those plies. You guys have not done plies. So let's see some plies, yeah? Remember, you've gotta stay focused to be a good ballerina. All right, I'll be right back, you guys. Keep going. Keep going, I'm watching you even when I'm not. Where'd she just go? I don't know. I'll be back. Wait, but are we supposed to be doing plies? Rebecca, what are you doing? I told you to do plies with your best friend Lily. I wanted to make sure you were okay. I am okay. I was just doing a little work to make sure that I'm safe when I'm a black swan, okay? I love you. No matter what happens, I'll always love you, academy or not. Her mom's being so weird about that room. What do you think's in there? Matt, I thought you weren't eating any more sweets. I'll start that tomorrow. I can't believe you're the black swan mom. <sighs> My dreams are finally coming true and you got into the academy. Our dreams are coming true. <laughs> you're gonna do a great job. You couldn't be more proud. Thank mm -hmm. you guys. Yes. Congrats on being the black swan. Break a leg. Rebecca, you gotta go out to the audience, okay? Okay. You got this. Come Thank on. you. <sighs> this is it. <sighs> Rebecca, no, no, no! Mom! Oh no! Mom! 
Mom, no, please, wake up, please, Mom. Thank you everyone for coming here today. Jennifer loved the stage. Our daughter Rebecca would like to say a few words. My mom is the best mom ever. She taught me how to dance. She always comforted me when I was sad. And we had so much fun together. And I'm gonna miss you, because you were the best mom ever. And I don't think I could ever do ballet again without you. <laughs> Five, six, seven, eight. here to convince you to come back to the academy with me. There is no way she's gonna do that, especially after what happened to her mom. I don't do ballet anymore. You know what happened to my mom. I'm a hip hop dancer now. Come on, Rebecca. Natalie's gonna be the black swan and she is so horrible. She's bullying everyone. Natalie? Yeah, Nina's daughter? Yeah, you're the only one who can stop her. You have to come back with me, please. I, I don't think I can. Just come with me, just see how it looks. You don't have to make any decisions. What are we supposed to do without you? I gotta go, I'm so sorry. But I'll be back soon, this won't take long. Okay, Lily, let's do this. Thank you, let's go. Just practice without me! What do we do now? I guess we'll figure it out with just us two. Wow, I haven't been here in forever. Yeah, it looks pretty much the same. We got new lockers. Oh, new lockers. So, what do you think? I think they're lockers. Natalie always tries to take this one, but there's no names on them. They're for anyone. Why did you bring me here, Lily? I really wanted you to see how awful Natalie is, but also... What? Because of that. The yellow door. My mom used to go in there. She's the only one who knows the four-digit code. I'm not sure if you knew it. No, I didn't know it. So no one's been in there since? No, and I think if we can get in there, we can finally see that Nina killed all of the black swans. You think Nina is the reason my mom died? Yeah, and we can get justice for all of them. Hurry, hide, Natalie's coming. What are you even doing here, loser? That's Natalie, Nina's daughter? I haven't seen her since I was 10 years old. There's no chance you're gonna be the black swan. That part is mine. Why are you so mean to me? I can't help it. I've done nothing to you. But it's just your face is so big. In fact, you're actually ruining the equipment, so. Lily was right, she is a bully. Well, there is no way I'm letting her bully my best friend. That is completely unnecessary. Rebecca, what are you even doing here? You're not part of the academy. Well, I'm making sure that my best friend is okay and isn't getting bullied, which clearly she is. Um, it's not bullying if it's telling the truth. You know, I was here to watch my best friend Natalie, but now I have a new agenda. I'm gonna be the black swan. <laughs> you can't be the black swan. You're not even part of the academy. Your chances are like basically zero. You sound a little afraid, Natalie. Me, afraid? No. <laughs> <laughs> well then I guess I'll see you at tryouts. Fine. What are you smiling about? Ah. Okay, Mom. I can't believe I'm gonna do this. I never thought I'd be able to do ballet after what happened to you. But I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna find out what happened to you. A black swan outfit. This is the crown she wore. <gasps> ballet shoes. She wore these all the time. They fit. Hey guys! Is everything all right? Yeah, why'd you call us here? I have something to tell you guys. I think I'm gonna try to join the ballet academy. What? Yo, that's what? exciting! Hey, yes. You can follow in your mom's footsteps. Yeah, except I have to get into the academy first. And I was hoping you guys could help me. Of course, it's like we got you. Mm -hmm. I heard the academy is really hard to get into, so if you wanna stand out, you gotta do something different. I think we're gonna have to add a hip hop flair to the ballet. Exactly. I like that. So, plie and releve. I think we gotta make yeah. it a little groovier. Yeah? Yeah, let's go. Uh -oh. oh, I like that. Uh -oh. Nice. <laughs> what do you think of my arabesque? Nice, but let's add some hip hop to it. Okay. So how about an arabesque and then moonwalk? Oh! Oh my god. Uh? Oh.
to get into the academy. <sighs> yeah. Up next, auditioning for the academy is Rebecca. You got this, Rebecca. Got this. but in a good way. You took ballet and added hip hop, which keeps it fresh, and we need that around here. Welcome to the Academy. Really? Yeah. Oh! <laughs> Thank you! Ah! You did it, Rebecca! Thank you so Thank much, you. Lily, for helping me. Big deal, you made the Academy like everybody else, but you're never gonna be the black swan. Yes, I am. But more importantly, you have to figure out how to get in that yellow door. Yes. I can't believe we still don't know who the black swan is. We don't know, but it's down to the three of us, so I'm pretty sure you and I both still have a shot. It's what been, is it? I don't know, this shoe's been bugging. Hold on, look. What? It's a four digit code. Do you think that's the code to the yellow door? It might be, my mom hid it in her shoe. It's been hiding this whole time, I had no idea. If we can get in there, we might have evidence that Nina and Natalie are behind all of this. All of the black swans disappearing, yes. or dying. <gasps> Lily! Hide it, hurry! Lily! Before anyone finds it. Lily! <sighs> How many times have I had to tell you, don't put your water bottle in my locker? Or you'll regret it. Okay. Hey. Okay. Fighting, are you girls? No, no Miss Olga. Okay, let's go. It's time for rehearsal. Okay. Move. Okay, let's do this. Five, six, seven, eight. Plie and up. Plie and back. Crown. Bow. Finale. Oh, Miss Olga, I don't feel good. Can I take a break for a second? Quickly. I'm gonna check on her. Just two minutes. Okay. They are so not dedicated. Natalie must have poisoned her best friend. She can't get away with this. What's wrong, are you okay? I don't know what happened. I just drank the water from the water bottle. Do you think she did something to my water bottle? I don't know. I have to go to the bathroom. Oh no. Go back to rehearsal. Okay, I'm sorry, Lily. Did she actually do something to Lily's water? She's not getting away with this. Really, Natalie? You're so insecure about being a ballerina, you have to do something to someone's water? I don't know what you're talking about. Oh, and I'm sure you don't know anything about what happened to the black swans either. Okay, I have nothing to do with the fact that all the black swans are dead, including your mom. You did not just say that. Take it back! <laughs> Just like your mom. That is it. Cool off, Natalie. <sighs> Rebecca, I need to speak to you. She's trying to sabotage every ballerina just like she did all the black swans. She just lost her mother a year ago, so maybe a little empathy. She lost her mom a year ago? I didn't know that. If the two of you weren't the two best ballerinas in this academy, I would kick you both out. But for now, go cool off. <sighs> My sweater. The code to the yellow door! Who would have taken it? Natalie. Girls, I would like to congratulate all of you. You've trained very hard. But there can only be one black swan. And that is Rebecca. <gasps> oh, oh, no way! I've been training way too hard and I'm not gonna be a white swan again. <laughs> you did it! <gasps> oh, I'm gonna show you something real quick. What? <gasps> You know how Natalie never wants anyone going in her locker? Yeah. Well, I went in and look at what I found. What? Your sweater and <gasps> your digit code to the yellow door. I knew she took it! Which means that now we can go in the yellow room and finally get justice for the black swans. <gasps> Eight, two, four, six. <gasps> it worked. I finally get to see what my mom's big secret was. Oh, it's a detective board. It looks like your mom was trying to figure out who was doing all this. Those are all the black swans that died. And a question mark. There's an arrow. Nina. That's Natalie's mom. 
my mom thinks she's behind all these black swan murders. This is the evidence. Mm-hmm. Rebecca, look. Dear mother, I promise to carry on what you have done. Those are pictures of me. Natalie's the one behind killing all the black swans? That means Rebecca's next. Mother? Who's mother? Natalie. Natalie to her mother, Nina. She's the one carrying it on, and these are pictures of me, which means, especially now that I'm the black swan, she is after me. This makes so much sense. Do you remember when she got you sick with the water bottle? Yeah. She's the one who took my sweater, got the code. She's been the only one that's been able to be inside of here. Well, if I'm the next target, then we have to figure out a plan to stop Natalie. Especially if you are the black swan. Great job, Lily! Thank you. <laughs> oh man, I'm so nervous. I've trained my whole life to be the black swan, and now it's finally here. Don't be nervous. <sighs> Just stick to the plan. Stick to the plan so I can stay safe. And remember, your mom is watching you. Please welcome to the stage, Rebecca. You're up. otherwise. Come on. I'm innocent. <gasps> I'm so glad you're okay. She almost used this on me. Thank you so much, Lily, for setting up this tea party. You know how much I love them. We have to celebrate you being the black swan. How's your tea, Rebecca? I have not even tried it yet. Mmm. That's weird. My throat's like drying up or something. Are you okay? I don't know. Drink some more tea. Okay. It might help you feel better. Yeah. Mmm. No, it, it's Rebecca? getting worse. I'm losing feeling. It feels like tingling in my body. I, I think you should call 911. It's not gonna happen. Because then the cops would know who put the poison in your tea. What are you doing? I thought we were best friends. Ever since I was a little girl, when I saw what Natalie's mom did to your mom, I've been wanting to do the same thing. And I saw how much your mom loved you. What are you talking about? to kill all the black swans. And the only ones standing in my way were you and Natalie. Her best friend was behind it? No way! It all started when I convinced you to come back to the academy and then I could start my elaborate plan to frame Natalie. You framed Natalie? I put my water bottle in her locker and then when I saw that you got the code, I knew I had to have it. So I pretended to be sick and I framed Natalie for doing it. So Natalie didn't take the code? And when I finally got inside, I saw all that Nina had done, and I decided to take it a step further. By doing what? To make it seem like Natalie had done it all. But the knife on I stage! I put the knife in her locker, and of course she thought it was you. And when the cops came, that sealed the deal. So she went to jail for a crime she didn't commit. That's right. You two were the only ones standing in my way of becoming the black swan. And now the only one standing in my way is you. Or was you. I can't believe Rebecca died in this one. It's birth to death, Matt. I can't believe my best friend did that to me, you guys. These are getting too intense. I don't want to go on anymore. Well, you have to hurry. You have two more levels. You have to keep on going so we can get out of this program. Zadie's with the babysitter. And you have two more levels left. The next level is vampire. Well, she better not die in this one. This was supposed to be a shortcut home, but I think I'm lost. Hello? Hello? I don't know how we're gonna get home. <gasps> Two for the price of one. Ah! 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 Oh no, I need a hospital. Ah! Somebody help. Ah! Help. Ah! All right, 
Mary. I understand that we're having a baby today. Let me check out some vitals. Oh, have you been attacked by a vampire? I was. Okay. Ah! We're gonna have this baby right now. Ah! I need you to push with me. Stay with me. Give me a big push. One, two, three. Ah! Oh, it's a beautiful baby girl. Do you have a name for her? Rebecca. No, 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 no. Stay with me, listen. I'm a vampire, but I'm a good vampire. I'm gonna do everything I can to protect you. I promise. Just wake up, please. Happy birthday, Rebecca! Now make a wish, ready? I can't believe you're one year old, Rebecca! It's been a wonderful year. Thank you so much for everything you've done for me and my daughter. You saved both of our lives. Right, Rebecca? You're welcome, Mary. Time for your first piece of cake, little Rebecca. Ow! Mm. Oh, no! I cut myself. No, no, no. No, don't! Oh, no. Ah. No, this isn't strong enough! I need it! No. Ah. Stay back! I need, oh, I need a chewy. Take it. Take this. Stop. Stop. Stay back. Yeah. Uh, Rebecca, I'm so sorry. I promise I'll never hurt you. Uh. All right, Rebecca, I want you to watch closely. Grip the wooden spike like this. Look the evil vampire in the eyes. Kick, stab, right in the heart. I want you to try. Nice. Ah! Yes, you're a natural, Rebecca. You're a natural. Thanks, Dad. Oh, sorry. No, it's okay. You can call me dad. But why are we fighting vampires? I thought they were good. Vampires are good, like your mother. But there are some evil vampires out there that want my gummies. You see, these gummies prevent vampires from craving human flesh and blood. They also protect you from going out into the sun. However, there's evil vampires out there that want these gummies. And if they get these gummies, evil could take place. Which reminds me, it's time for your blood draw. Let's go. Why do you always have to take my blood? That's to keep you safe. Why can't I just eat a gummy like you and mom? Well, these gummies don't work for you. You're special. Oh no, that's your mother. Oh. Stay, stay here, don't move. No, you don't. I, mean, I am hungry. You're not yourself right I now. I need her. Bring her to me. You need a higher dose. I'm going to get some more gummies. Right, Rebecca. Mom. Rebecca. Are I can't. Okay? I can't breathe. Maybe you just need some air No. Oh. I'm hungry! Get off of her! Get off of her! Get off of her! Rebecca, what are you doing in here? Stay back. Mom! What Mom! happened? Mom! Your mother loved you very much. She left you this, though. It's locked. It's not to be opened until you turn 16. But how do I open it? She said you'll know when the time is right. I'm sorry. Goodbye, Mom. I love you. I can't wait to see what's inside of this box. Mom, I'm gonna find whatever vampire tried to kill you. And I promise, I'm gonna get revenge. I was just playing some basketball. Well, happy birthday! You're finally 16. You get to open the box that your mom gave you. Uh, I know, I know. I just have to figure out how to open it. Happy birthday, Rebecca! Uh, oh, 16. <laughs> hey, hi, Sydney. Hi. How are you? Good, how are you? Good. I have an extra special gift for you today. What? Yes. Really? I need you to close your eyes. Close what is your it? Eyes. Okay. We'll, we'll find out. Where am I going? Keep walking. How much farther? Keep walking. What is it? All right. Happy birthday. <gasps> so good. Oh, I'm being <laughs> Oh my gosh. There. Thank yes. you so much. I can't believe this. But dad, this box, I'm supposed to be able to open it on my 16th birthday, but I can't figure out how. Well, your mom said that you'll know when the time is right, so you'll figure it out. This Jeep's so cool. Come on, Rebecca. Go have fun. Okay. 
Yeah. Oh my gosh, this is awesome. Thank you so much. All right, you girls go have some fun. Okay, we will. Hey, sweetie. What was that? Oh, uh, he's just checking the tire pressure. Oh, okay. Isn't this so cool? Oh my gosh, <laughs> this is amazing. Oh, I just wish your mom could be here. She would have really loved this. I'm so sorry she had that heart attack. What's wrong? I'm so sorry, Rebecca. Pull over. Oh, I'm so sorry. Don't cry. <laughs> what is it? I can't tell you. No, oh, you can tell me. We're best friends, remember? I don't want you to be mad at me. How can I be mad at you? You can tell me anything. I've been lying to you. How? If my mom didn't die from a heart attack, my mom died because she's a vampire. A vampire? And I killed her. Wait, how did that happen? It was with the son and my dad's not my dad. He was a doctor that saved my mom when she got bitten. I'm sorry I didn't tell you. I just didn't think you'd understand. Of course it's okay, Rebecca. I have so many questions. None of this is making sense. But we're gonna be best friends no matter what. There's something moving in the back. No, it's just a boring pink jeep. Well, let's get back to the house. <laughs> it's your 16th birthday. Man, I have so much to tell you. You do. Being a vampire, it's pretty crazy. I can't wait to have my cake. <sighs> Why is my necklace glowing? I totally knew that girl was coming for her. Sydney! Sydney! Oh no! Oh no! Hey! Hey! Let my friend go! Let my friend go! <laughs> Give me back my mother's box! You have no idea what this possesses, what it can do for me, what it can do for my kind! Your kind brings evil to the world. I will bring evil to the world to the end of time. <laughs> now I'm going to kill you like I've killed your friend. <laughs> Not today. Get out of here. <laughs> Sydney! Sydney! <laughs> Sydney, she come here. The box. It's okay. Lay down. Oh, Dad! Coming. Dad! What happened? What happened? A vampire came and bit her and took the box. Please, what do I do? Sydney, wake up! Dad, what are you doing? What are you doing? Dad! I'm doing what I have to do. Dad! I'm so sorry. She's not breathing, Dad! I know. Sydney, I'm so sorry. What's going on? I had to do what I had to do. She was up. dying. She's a vampire. How do you feel? Freezing. Here, take one of these. You made her a vampire. Trust me. Let's get her inside. What? Dad. Come on me. Come on me. I can't believe that we are both going to prom and we both have dates. I can't believe I'm going to prom as a vampire. You okay? Here, I don't feel normal. Here, here, here. Eat one of these. My dad says you'll get used to the cravings, okay? Girls! This is gonna be the best prom ever. Hello, officer, how can I help you? How's it going? We've had some break-ins in the area and we just wanted to secure your backyard and make sure that everybody was safe. Sure. Do I have permission to answer as well as my partner? She's right behind me. Yeah. Come on in, come on in. So, I mean, the backyard's just it's right over here. <laughs> Rebecca, I really like you. I really like you too. You know, I would never let anything happen to you. Really? Yeah. <laughs> you are going to tell me exactly how to open this box. He'll never figure it out. Then you are of no use to me. <laughs> <laughs> Pathetic. No! There's something I actually have to tell you. You see, I, I. What's wrong with your necklace? Uh, you know what? I, I'm so sorry. I have to go home. I, right I, now? I'm sorry. Yeah. Calm. I, I'm sorry. I have to go. Dad! 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 Dad, are you okay? You have to get the case. 
has the secret gummy formula. Right now, tell me how I can save you. Dad! Dad! Who's gonna protect her if her dad's not here? <laughs> A new number. If you want your mom's box back, meet me at the Shadow Pines Forest on the bridge. The vampire that took my mom's box and tried to kill my best friend is the one that killed my dad. I'm so sorry. I'm gonna get that box back. The bridge. Hello? You have my mom's box. Are you the one that killed my dad? I want my mother's box back. You think I'd be stupid enough to bring it? You're going to tell me how to open it. You killed my father. Of course we did. And if you don't help us, you're next. <laughs> you're going to tell me how to open that box. I don't know how to open the box, and if I did, I would never tell you. Then I'll just have hey. No, 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 no. You're not gonna hurt her. You have to come through me. Finally, someone's gonna save her. No! Dylan, no! So much for that. You brought! I'll be back! Dylan, I'm so sorry I brought you into this. <laughs> Sydney, what are you doing? Oh, I'm gonna go study at the library. What? But I just ordered a pizza for us. I'll see you later. <sighs> okay, fine. Just be studying alone in our apartment. Don't miss me. Pizza delivery. Oh, I'll grab some cash. Come on in. Hello, darling. <laughs> what are you doing here? I'm here for you to finally tell me how to open that box. Well, I'm not gonna do that. Well, then I'll have to kill you. Just like I killed your father. And like I killed your mother. You bit my mom. Oh, I bit your mom. Then it looks like I'm gonna have to kill you. <laughs> This'll be fun. <laughs> Where are we? Welcome to where I killed your mother. Or at least attempted to. Somehow that wench escaped death. But I won't make that mistake again. Now tell me, how do I open the lockbox? I don't know. Where is it? You'll never find it, even if it was right under my nose. And now, it's time to die. No! Ah! <laughs> <sighs> She's gone. If she died, how's Rebecca supposed to find the box? <laughs> Thank you, Sydney, for walking me to my mother's grave. Of course. Now that I'm getting much older, I don't have much time. Don't talk like that, Rebecca. I don't want to lose you. It's just the reality. I'm not a vampire like you. There it is. Dear mother. Rebecca, what is that? That's the jacket of the vampire I killed. The one who took my mother's box. I just wish I could have gotten her to tell me where it was before I killed her. What did she say? She said I wouldn't be able to find it even if it was under my nose. Under your nose? She said it was under my nose. Under your nose? The jacket. <gasps> Here, look inside it. I don't understand. <sighs> she was wearing the jacket, she said under my nose. It could have been on her. Is there something, some clue? I don't see anything. Look. Oh, there's something in there. <gasps> What does it say? I don't believe it. It's a map. 
Where does it go to? We're right here, and the map it would be right up there. There's an X. Come on. Oh, maybe that's it. We're getting close. It should be right over there, near that tree. Oh, Rebecca, what's this? Oh, I think we found it, Rebecca. Uh, uh, here, let me help you. Uh, uh, I can't believe it. This is my mother's box that the vampire had taken from me. <gasps> what is happening? I don't know. Oh, it opened. Something dropped. Where is it? I don't know. The key! It's been in my locket the whole time. <gasps> it's a note. Blood cube formula. Oh, this. What's inside it? It's a journal. My mother's journal. My little angel and mommy. Oh, The best day of my life. My mother loved me. I will always love you. And what does it say, Rebecca? Rebecca, I love you more than life itself. And you are the secret ingredient the doctor used to keep me and the other vampires alive. Love mom. Your mom really loved you. She just couldn't handle the cravings. You know what it's like. And the blood gummies didn't work for her anymore. <laughs> That's why the doctor, he always drew my blood. My blood was what kept my mother alive. Blood cube formula. Three milliliters of Rebecca's blood mixed with vitamin D, iron, and sodium chloride. It was you. Which means I have to save you guys before I die. I know what I need to do. Are you sure you want to do this? This will be the last bag. Yes. If my blood can keep vampires alive, I want to donate all of it. But this is going to kill you. Sydney. Thank you for being a great best friend. Please don't forget me. I'll never forget you. Rebecca? Rebecca? No! I can't lose you! Rebecca! See, she didn't have to die. <gasps> you really think a vampire is living? I'm craving blood right now. <laughs> What's that? No, what? I'm just kidding. The next level is Barbie. <gasps> Finally a fun one. How is Barbie gonna be fun? You're having uh, contractions. We need to go to the hospital. No, I need to get this Barbie doll first. I promised I'd get it before she was born. <gasps> Here it is, the last one. I was gonna get that for my granddaughter. She's sick. You know what? You can have it. Oh. oh. No, you can take it. Thank you. Ah. Oh. Ooh, the baby's coming. We need you go to the hospital right now. We don't have time. The baby's coming now! I'm gonna get some help! Ah. Hey, hey. Ma'am, I need you to stay calm and give me three big pushes. Are you a delivery nurse? I used to be. Okay. One, two, three. Ah. Oh, my daughter! What's her name? Emma. <laughs> Once you take this Barbie home, you adopt her, and she'll always be there for her. Thank you. I couldn't find anybody! <gasps> this is Emma. <laughs> Emma, meet your dad. And this is Barbie. <laughs> you did this by yourself? No, the lady helped deliver her for me. What lady? The lady right... Where'd she go? Okay, Emma! Happy first birthday! No applause or candle! <sighs> Yay! Happy birthday! I have a very special gift for you. It's a Barbie! Your very first Barbie! Do you love Barbie? <laughs> okay, Princess Emma, I have something very special for you. It's the key to our fortune. So if anything happens to Mommy and Daddy, you get to keep the key. Why don't you keep this for now? I got it. There's one more huge surprise upstairs. I just want to make sure it's set up. So I'll call you when it's ready, okay? Wait right here, Emma! Mwah! Be right back! I can't believe you're one years old already. Emma is going to be so excited when she sees this. Emma's gonna love the secret dollhouse that we built for her. Oh. What was that? Emma. Kate, 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 where are you? Kate! Oh no, no, what happened to your mom? Kate, wake up, wake up, wake up, wake up, wake up! Your mom has no pulse. No. Kate! You are here at detention. 
in, which means you did something bad. Before we get to working, I want you to each let me know why you are here, starting with you, Miss Emma. Someone tried to take my Barbie. I just wanted it back. I heard about that altercation. There is no reason to get physical. Yes, Sophia. I'm here because I personally think Barbie dolls should not be allowed at an elementary school. They're literally for babies and nerds. That's an opinion, not the reason you're in detention. Connor. I'm here because I was defending my friend. Emma, I would do anything for her. This isn't fair. Life's not fair, Connor. I need to take this. You guys, open your books, start working. This is detention. Looks like there's no teacher here to save you, nerd girl. Hey, give my Barbie back. Give it back, her mom gave that to her. All you've got is this dumb Barbie. Give it to me. Why should I? Hey, you're not supposed to call me. I have detention right now. Sure, I'd love to have a date in the library. It's not even like this Barbie can help you make friends. Hey! I gotta go, I'll text you. Kids! Give me my doll back! Girls, 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 what is going on? Have a seat in your desks. What is happening? Sophia took my Barbie doll and she won't give it back. Did not, it just fell on the floor so I picked it up for her. That's not what happened. Emma, you need to stop bringing that Barbie doll to class. Sophia, give her back her doll. Fine. It's not like this doll's gonna bring your mom back. Now, you, hey! Emma, detention is not done. You two, start studying and working. I gotta take care of this. Emma, Emma, you cannot just leave detention. Sophia's so mean to me. She makes fun of my clothes and everything I do. And if I don't bring this doll to school, I don't know what I'm gonna do. Listen, Emma, I know losing your mom was tough, but a doll's not gonna make anything better. I wish it could. It's not fair. I can't bring you to school, and you're all I have left of my mom. What's this? I'll come to life and be your best friend. But once I find your true love, my time as a human comes to an end. I wish you could come to life, but you can't. You're just the Barbie. Hello, Emma. Barbie, are you real? I think so. Yes, I am. The note worked. No. I'll come to life and be your best friend. But once I find you true love, my time as a human comes to an end. I guess I am real. I adopted Barbie. Come on, I have to show you to my dad. Dad? Dad, this is Barbie. Hi, Barbie. Hello. Isn't Emma the best? It's pretty great. Dad, can you please get ice cream? I don't know, I don't think now's a good time. Please. What's ice cream? It's a yummy cold dessert with so many different flavors. That sounds delicious. See Dad, Barbie hasn't had any. Please, please. Okay, everybody in the car. Yay! You're gonna love ice cream, Barbie. I can't wait, I'm so excited. Listen, Emma, I have a lot of work I need to get done, but I'm doing this for you. Look out! <laughs> <laughs> Barbie, are you okay? I think so, what was that? I think we were in a car accident. Are you okay, Dad? Dad? Dad! 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 He's not breathing! Uh, we need to call 911! 911, how do we do that? Dad! <sighs> I'm really sorry about what happened to your dad. I just can't believe he's gone. I won't let anything happen to you, I promise. We're both here for you. Looks like you have no parents now. What are you even doing here? This is for friends and family only. Who are you? You look like that stupid doll she used to carry around. Don't listen to her. <sighs> the key your dad gave you, you're wearing it. It's to our family fortune. I give it all to have them back. Emotional. Yeah, I thought this was supposed to be fun. Okay, maybe if she can find that girl true love, there'll be a happy ending. 98, 99, 100. Hairbrush? No thanks. So, Emma, I was thinking after school today, you and I could go get ice 
cream. I actually can't today. I have to go hang out with friends. You've been hanging out with friends all week. I know, I've just been super busy. Something feels weird about that Emma girl. I don't think she's telling the truth. It's okay, you're popular, and that is a great thing, especially if I'm supposed to find you true love. Go ahead, hang out with your friends. Maybe we can do it this weekend. I have to head to school. I'll see you, bye Barbie, bye. You know what? Maybe I can surprise her after school and invite all of her friends to ice cream. Great idea, Barbie. <sighs> Emma, Sophia, Connor, you three have been in detention all week. Emma, she's in detention? What's going on? I'm not gonna be friends with her until she stops making fun of my friend. You mean that weird girl that dresses like a Barbie? <laughs> She's not weird, and her name is Barbie. Whatever, nerd. She's in detention because she was defending me? Besides her, Emma has no friends. Emma does have friends. She's been hanging out with them all week. I'm her friend. Shut up, nerd. Hey, hey! The neighbor boy's a nerd? She should not hang out with him. You three need to get along. You're gonna keep coming into detention until you get along. Now get back to work. Taking Emma's backpack. You're 14. Aren't you too old for Barbie coloring books? Ah! Oh, stop! What happened? Emma just hit me. Emma. She's getting bullied, and the teacher isn't doing anything. If her other friends were here, this would not be happening. I need to talk to the principal. Principal Keenly. It's Kenley. I knew a Ken once. Anyways, I'm here to discuss Emma, who's in detention right now, and she is getting bullied. Wait, who are you again? I Emma's guardian. I'm Barbie. So anyways, like I said, she's getting bullied and I think you need to do something about it. If it's in detention, the teachers will handle that. Okay, you know what? This would not be happening if all of her friends were there. If Emma's friends were here. Yes. Emma's birthday is tomorrow. I'll just invite all of her friends and surprise her. You know what? Could I have the class list with all of their names and numbers? If you say so, sent. Perfect. She's going to be so surprised. Even though you cannot help with detention, you are going to make her surprise party the most epic birthday ever. Thank you so much. Oh no, she thinks she's doing something nice. This is not gonna end well. Have a barbtastic day. Are we talking about the same Emma? I thought Connor was her only friend. Emma, wake up. Happy 14th birthday! Thanks, Barbie. Make a wish. Before you eat this, a huge surprise for you downstairs. Really? Yeah, let's go. Oh, wait, wait, wait. You have to keep your eyes closed. Oh, I can't see. That's the point. What is it, Barbie? You have to tell me. You can open your eyes. Surprise! This is so cool. Yeah, we are having an epic pool party and I invited your entire class. All of them? Yes, all of your friends. I finally get to meet all of your friends. Happy birthday, Emma. Barbie, I'm not so sure about this. They should be here by now, but they're probably running a little bit late. No, why don't we just take the cake? No, 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 no. I want them to see this entire spread. This is for you, so let's just wait till they get here. Barbie, no one's coming. What are you talking about? I'll be here. no friends. None. They all hate me and they what? think I'm weird. I can't. No. <laughs> but, but she's been hanging out with all of her friends. <sighs> I'm sorry, I'm late. I was at Chess Appreciation Club, but I got her this. I know how much she likes Barbie. Oh, yeah. Can you leave it Where? there? I'll be back. Feel free to take a cupcake. I was right. No one showed up. She has no friends. Why are you happy about that? At least that neighbor boy Connor's nice to her. Hey, Emma. I'm sorry I told you I had friends. I didn't want you to not like me. I like you no matter what. I'm here because of you. And besides, I have to find you true love. True love? I'm not even popular. You're right. It would be so much easier if you were popular. I am Barbie and there is one thing I know and that is how to be popular. Do you trust me? What is Barbie gonna do? Do you think it'll help her find true love? Really? I am positive you will now become the most popular girl in school. Step one of finding true love. And I almost forgot. You need your backpack and your little backpack. Is that a Louis Vuitton? Everyone is going to die when they see this. Now go have the best day ever at class. Bye, Barbie. Bye. She looks gorgeous. I did good. Look at their reactions. Hey, Emma. Hey. Is that a Louis 
Tom backpack? Yeah, it is. Do you want to get ice cream after school? Sure. Can I come? No. It's working! That girl that used to bully her now wants to get ice cream with her! One step closer to finding true love. High five, Barbie. This prom dress is so cute. Oh my oh gosh, my it's so fantastic! <laughs> <gasps> no way, the bully and her are best friends? She must be really popular. And this mm. one. <laughs> oh my god, I love that one. That would look so good on you. But it's $2,000. <laughs> oh, who cares? Emma, I can make that dress for one fourth of the cost. Really? Uh huh. <laughs> Anyways, speaking of prom, who do you want to go to prom with? I don't know, but as long as he's popular. <laughs> True love! <laughs> I think I know someone who wants to ask you to prom. Really? <gasps> Is it Connor? Barbie, can you get us two Cokes and a glass bottle? Like now. Emma? Actually, that sounds good if you don't mind, Barbie. Yeah, so go on. Sure, Emma. Thanks. So anyways, you should totally get that $2,000 dress. You think? Yeah, it looks so good. It's super cute. Okay. My mom just texted me. I probably have to call her back. Okay. <laughs> Sophia girl might be popular, but she is horrible. I must have it. But if this doesn't work, we'll just go to plan B. Either way, we'll get our family's fortune. <laughs> I gotta go. Bye. That bully's not her best friend. She's trying to steal her family fortune. But the bigger question is, who is she talking to? Did I just hear that correctly? Is Sophia her best friend trying to steal her family fortune? I knew I didn't like her. I need to let Emma know. Oh, hey, Connor. <laughs> Hey, what did your mom say? You know moms. Anyways. <laughs> well, here you go, Emma and Sophia. Here are your Cokes. Oh, we don't need those anymore. <laughs> Emma, I have to tell you something. What is it? Emma, I have a surprise. Does it have to do with prom? Uh-huh, it's right outside. No, no. way. <laughs> Close your eyes. Okay. Um, Let's Emma, go. just... <sighs> oh, no, I'm gonna have to tell her after this. Are you ready? Yeah. Three, two, one. <gasps> Were you gonna prom with me? Ryan? Yes. <laughs> She's going to prom. But her necklace is gone. Wait, Sam was it there earlier? Go back and watch. I'm so excited. I'm so, so excited. I think we're going to be prom king and queen. <gasps> I think so. I'm pretty <laughs> sure. <laughs> One step closer to finding true love. But now I have to tell her that her best friend is trying to steal her family fortune. Oh my gosh, I cannot believe that Ryan asked me to prom. Thank you so much, Sophia. <laughs> Emma, I have something to tell you. Sophia is trying to steal your family fortune. Huh? Look, your key, it's gone. Sophia? I would never. I heard her talking to someone on the phone. Her plan was to take your family fortune this whole time. Barbie's just trying to sabotage us because we're friends. She's just jealous. No, I I'm not jealous. I just want to save your family fortune. Barbie's just trying to set me up. Maybe she stole it. What? I would not never, Emma, no way. That's not true. Is it? Let's check your purse. Fine, Emma. To prove to you that I would never steal it. Look, lip gloss, powder. What? Barbie, how could you? Emma, I would never, I promise. I don't know how that got in here. Clearly you put it in there. I'm just glad you know the truth now. Well, I'll see you at prom. <laughs> The bully totally set her up. I just don't know how. Emma, you have to trust me. I would never do that to you. I would never steal your family fortune. Then how was it in your purse, Barbie? Please don't come to prom. You're joking. We've been dreaming about this your whole life. True love. You can leave. I need some time alone. Please, Barbie. Emma, I would never, and you know that. Leave. Rebecca has to do something. But she's not allowed to go to prom. What's she gonna do? It didn't go as planned. I had to improvise. Plan B will happen at prom. Did you hear that? What is plan B? I know that Emma does not want me to go to prom, but I have to protect her. So I just have to figure out a way to get to prom without her knowing. A disguise? Well, what's the opposite of Barbie? It looks like Wednesday Barbie is going to prom. <clears throat> it's Wednesday! No, I'm pretty sure prom's on a Friday or a Saturday. No, Barbie is Wednesday. I said go away, Barbie! Connor? Connor? What are you doing here? Hi, Emma. Hey. Thought you might want some ice cream. I love ice cream! Ice cream if you went to prom with me. Oh, that's really nice, but Ryan already asked me. The popular guy? Yeah. I thought he's... He's what? A nice guy? Because he is. Okay, look, I'm sorry. Um, This is really nice, but... You can keep it. You've been a really great friend, but I can take care of myself now. Uh, I guess yeah. I'll see you around. See you around. I'm 
here at prom and Emma has no idea that it's me. I'll go get us some drinks. Thanks. <laughs> yeah. Perfect. There you go. Thank you. Nerd. I heard you're gonna be prom queen. You're just so I need to fix my hair. I'll be right back. <laughs> Sophia. Plan B is all set. I made sure she's gonna be prom queen. Soon we'll have her fortune. <laughs> Meet me by the bathrooms later. <laughs> who is she talking to? She has a plan set up to steal the fortune, but I don't know who she's working with. Who is that? Connor? Connor? Her next door neighbor has been betraying her this whole time? Ah! Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Steal her Barbie! Get off me, get off me! <gasps> Barbie? You're working with Sophia to steal her family fortune, how could you? No, 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 I, I would never do that to Emma. I heard everything! I would never do that to her. But I think I knew who is. Follow me. Do you think he's telling the truth, Sam fam? I don't know, but I have to find out. I'm gonna go use the bathroom real fast. I'll be here. Okay. Thanks. Do you remember the plan? Yeah. Ryan's working with Sophia? I knew it. I dip the crown in this. The Let's second she puts it on her head, she Goodbye, got... Emma, and the Hello Fortune. They were gonna poison her when she becomes prom queen. And then there's still her fortune. The fortune's <laughs> gonna be ours, babe. Oh, what are you doing? We need proof. What? They're gonna see us, get back. I thought Ryan was our true love. I mean, he's the most popular. But I guess it doesn't work like that in the real world. I really hope this plan works out because I can't afford to lose Emma. It's time to announce this year's prom king and queen. This year's king is Ryan. <laughs> guess that. Yes. All right, out of my head. Nice. And this year's prom queen is Emma. <laughs> oh, can I crown her? Absolutely. Oh, thank you. Oh, careful. Stop! The crown is poisonous. Ryan and Sophia are working together to steal your family. Fortune! Barbie? I told you not to come to prom! Not only are they trying to steal your family fortune, they are a couple! That's so not true! And you have no proof. Actually, I do. They were kissing earlier when you were in the bathroom. Sophia? Ryan? And get it, Teddy. This is the poison that they dip the crown in. How could you? I'll take that and I'll take you to the authorities, young man. Barbie. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry about how I treated you. You're the only real friend I have. You're my only real friend too, Emma. I love you. I love you, Barbie. Now let's get out of here, okay? Not so fast! No! Connor? Okay, young lady, you're in a lot of trouble. You were never the most popular anyway. You don't deserve that fortune. I do. She was never your friend. She was just a bully. Do you mind if I talk to him? Of course not. I'm really sorry about how I treated you. You've always been there for me and you're my true love. Hello. Uh, Barbie, what's wrong? I fulfilled my purpose. You found true love. And I'm so happy for you. Barbie. Goodbye, Emma. Barbie! <laughs> Barbie! Barbie! You are my best friend and I don't know what I'm gonna do without you. It's gonna be okay. I'm here for you. Thanks. <laughs> How did she beat the program? That's impossible. I need to get out of here. They can't know that I did this. Oh. We did it! We made it out of the program! Who's the one who trapped us in there? I think it was that curly-haired guy. Sam Bam, comment below. Do you have any guesses on who that strange person was? <laughs>